Handling success at a young age, is, it's not easy. Um, you definitely need a good team around you. you know, my family is very involved in my golf, but also I've had the same team since I turned 18, and this is my 15th year out on tour, so consistency is huge. But I really do feel that when you're younger, you never really sit there and say, good job, you know, pat yourself on the back. And looking back on it now in my career, I wish I would have taken you know, five or 10 minutes after a win or whether it was I came back and finished top five when I was in 50th place, you know, going into Sunday, and really just sitting there and saying, you know, Paula, that was great, you know, good job, let's not move on too quickly, kind of give yourself that little bit of a, a confidence booster. So I think for young kids, it's important to be able to just reflect on, on what you have accomplished, um, because it does make it much easier as your career goes on. When you do win, you know, it is that exciting, it is a good thing. Dealing with an injury, is it's not easy. Um, I think everybody thinks once they have surgery or you're better, like you just pop out of bed and you're ready to go, but it takes a lot longer. I think patience is so key. Um, being realistic with your goals is also very, very important. I remember after my, my surgery in 2010 uh, with my thumb, you know, I thought I was gonna come right back out and be on top of the world. And, when I hit my first ball in the driving range and I was chipping, I was thinking, am I ever going to play golf again? And then my fourth tournament back out, I won the US Open. So having that mindset of just being out there and being happy that you're playing pain free is, I think, the easiest way to go about the actual injury. It'll take time, but be realistic with everything as well.